Best. Huh. I'm gonna miss this place when I go to college. Hey Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Can't wait to see what Harry's been up to. An arms deal. Not good. Spider Man! Hate to interrupt a business meeting, but. Wait! No, I don't! Got a gift for you, Spidey! <laughs> business deals. Nobody ever expects fighters. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Crystal. More Marco memories scattered all over New York. 
And the sandcastle competition starts now! And no cheating! You just had to make it hard, huh? Crystal. So I told the cops that someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. Time to take matters into my own hands. Marco was really laying low these past few years. It would have helped him if I'd known he was in trouble. Hey, I was just talking to my source at the raft. Marco's been belligerent and incoherent since he got there. But they said he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, keep it up. What's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Feast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with everything. I'll call him right now. But don't push yourself too hard, Parker. You like fire? Hey, need a dance partner? Catch up that tanker fast! Thanks for the assist. Just trying to keep up with you. Guys, you're kinda getting 
sand everywhere! You guys should really leave and go somewhere more tropical! Probably check out it's that my crystal now. To follow them. Figure out who they are. I end up with this. Marco must have felt so alone during all this. His back against the wall. I can relate. That couple's being attacked. Better hurry. I'm gonna fight Spider-Man with my last breath. It's time to fight. <laughs> Why don't you guys use your strength to help others? I'm sure Feast would appreciate the help. Watching you take them down was something else. My knees hurt just watching you. was. You made it! I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less... this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker! <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. And now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> uh, 
right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Did what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, the carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were trained to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee wolves. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Check the hive. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Great. Flying home. Welcome to Entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. Did 
This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Did you do the XRF analysis? Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road-ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. This is what it's like working for an Osborne. Welcome to entomology. Beehives show complex... Drones? Yeah, uh, doing a little cross-collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultralight drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Could start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing the chances of... Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. I wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? I wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. Welcome to Space Museum. Fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yeah. Japanese koi fish have well studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco friendly roofing materials. So cool. Love this place.
Yeah. You know what this one here? Yeah. Yeah. That's the furthest from the yeah. axis. Yeah. Let's draw that up. Yeah. 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 What's your call? Now can we please go get some lunch? The Emily May Foundation is working on a proposal to renovate and expand the city's... That looks... familiar. Oh, this is a new form, if that's what you're thinking. It's decommissioned. We just want to know if there's anything to be learned from it for an alternate, safe energy source. Good to know. Attention. Please use caution near the part of the incinerator today. We are performing maintenance and you're making straight cases. Interesting. Negative energy. We are trying to harness it in a way that is beneficial. That would be a good trick. Good luck. Let's step back and restate the problem. The problem is these red markers. Why do they dry out faster than the others? Because you overuse them. Why do you have to make everything wet? Focus. Accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school, middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the. Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project, and lowers the old cortisol levels too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. Hello? Yes, we need someone to come back and check the well, conditions. The member system and end the degree of root to be extracted? Mm -hmm. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. This way, dude. Mm -hmm. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal quality. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting.
Let's see. I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Combine these traits. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Beautiful work, Peter. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off -y. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? Veronica. You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. Go ahead. Swipe. I really think you wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Make my mom and me proud, huh? It's 
amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the locations, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new... Can I get back to you in a minute? And we're back. So, like I was saying, this new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Guys, same time next week. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Let's look for the best samples. There has to be a healthy looking plant around here somewhere. are clearly more efficient with water. I can use that. This one's really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. This one's technically a weed, 
but the hardiness could be helpful. Okay, got some great samples. Time to bring them together. I can't believe that EMF is making these GMOs open source. Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it comes to basic human necessities. Let's see. Can't wait to see this grow. This works. These plants will be growing faster and bearing more fruit than ever. Just imagine what Feast could do with all of that. Okay, made some great new hybrid seeds for them. Just gotta get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. I just gotta patch this up. The webs should do the trick. Ugh. Seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. Just a few more to patch up. Be counterproductive if I drowned all the plants. May used to have a green thumb with her tomato plants. Maybe I have green webs? I think this should do it. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He doesn't need to know Spider-Man helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? What do they do? Well, oh, big picture. It's an Oscorp spinoff, which we don't love, I know, but the man in charge, Harry Osborne, has got a decent rep. At the very least, he hired my... It to the authorities to clean this up. Say what you will about social media, and I can say a lot. It helps so many businesses stay afloat here when they would have fallen under a long time ago. Stolen tech. Off the streets it goes.
that a sand crystal? Those things are everywhere. Does anyone have sunscreen? And will one of you do my back, please? They won't give up! Crystal time. I find them, and they're waiting for me with all sorts of weapons. What the hell have I walked into? Weapons? Whoever they are. They definitely read up on Marco. Hey, Pete, you got a minute? I could use some perspective on our mutual friend. What Jonah do this time? Usually I can deal with him, but lately it's like he's determined to get under my skin. You're a veteran. Any advice? With Jonah, it's a never-ending war. Trust me, pick your battles. You learn how to tune him out eventually. I'm not sure I have that superpower, Spider-Man. I know I can't die on every hill, but... But you're Mary Jane Watson, defender of truth. A much cooler superpower. <laughs> but maybe you have to give an inch to get one? Ugh, I don't know. I'll think about it. Thanks, Parker. Anytime, Watson! Thanks for coming. We've managed to set our explosives in every zone except the last one. The demo crew's in there. There's four of them. I'll find them. Just keep your radios open. And make sure nobody touches that detonator. No. Spiderbot can search faster in there than I can. Your time to shine, little guy. Make Spidey Daddy proud. Find the people, Clark gets them out. Is anyone out there? Help! Is that a robot? Hey, it's Spider Man. I just relayed your location to fire and rescue, so they'll be here any minute. It's gonna be okay. Spider Man, thank you. Hey, Clark. 
you get the location I just sent over? Our team's moving in now. Thanks. Spider-Man's here. It's gonna be okay. Thank you. Fire and Rescue knows where you are, and they'll be here soon. You're going to be okay. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Clark, you should be getting a new location any time now. Just came in. We'll head right over once we finish getting Mr. Robleski out. I said someone else is still trapped in here. Really? I'm not missing anyone else. But if you can find them, we'll get them out. I'm on it. Nobody here. Come <laughs> on. 
I've fought these people before. Organized and fanatical. Captain, I'm getting big cult vibes. What about the intruder that's been skulking around? They can't stop all of us. Now keep looking for supplies. We'll need them in the days ahead. What are they? Oh no. I didn't say anything to the police. Never, never even mentioned the flame. I just, I just wanted out. Then you should have remembered we all go out the same way we come in. Painfully. Oh, my God. 